my hair is back to its natural colour, I'm no longer dyeing it, and I'm just going to show you today how I style it. So step one, I'm going to wet my hair, it's currently dry, I've got no product in it whatsoever. I got this water bottle off Amazon for like four or five pounds, it's super convenient, it means that I can just fill it with water, spray it all over my hair, get it nice and wet, ready for the next stage. So as you can see, in terms of growth, it is a lot longer, but I've been allowing the sides to grow out a little bit more, I've still got a long way to go and I'm still kind of in like a limbo where it doesn't look great, but it doesn't look shit. So today, I'm just gonna show you how I achieve that side part in style that's really simple, it looks clean, it looks aesthetic, and it's actually quite easy to do. So I'm gonna be using a bit of hydrating oil in my hair because I'm gonna be using a hair dryer today. I wanna to be able to ensure that I protect my hair. Then I'm also gonna be using a sea salt spray. This is great for adding a little bit of volume to your hair. So when I go through the drying process, I'll be able to dry it in the right direction. It's gonna sit nicely and it's gonna look like there's a lot of product in there, but there won't be much. And now I'm gonna be drying my hair. So I'm literally just gonna use a hair dryer with this flat head on here so I can actually push the, the heat in the direction that I want it. So a reason for using the hydrating oil as well is it's gonna protect your hair. You don't wanna be holding the hair dryer right next to your head. That heat is gonna be damaging. So leave it a little bit far away and use your fingers as a comb. So nice and easily, I'll show you what I'm gonna do. So I'm just working the hair in the direction that I want it to sit. With the sea salt spray and the hydrating oil, it's gonna be protected, it's gonna have a little bit of volume, and it's gonna sit pretty much where I want it before I finish off this style. My hair's dry now. As you can see, it's got a nice little bit of volume just from utilizing that sea salt spray. So next, I'm gonna be using a matte paste. I'm only gonna be putting a tiny little bit of this on my hair just to kind of push it into position so it gives it that nice hold. As you can see, tiny little bit on my finger. Yeah, and I'm just gonna work that in the direction that I want my hair to sit, just using my fingers as a comb. So I'm gonna be finishing this off by using a little bit of hairspray. What I'm gonna do, I'm gonna take this comb, I'm gonna spray hairspray on the comb, and then I'm just gonna run it through my hair. Rather than only being able to put hairspray on the top layer of my hair, it's gonna be able to get in nicely, which again is gonna give it a little bit more hold. Now I'm just gonna use my fingers then just to create that more kind of natural chilled out vibe rather than really kind of fine comb lines in my hair. And I'm just gonna finish it off by putting a little bit of spray on the top. And there we go, nice simple style. This is my kind of go-to at the minute with the current length of my hair. It looks good, it's relatively easy to achieve and I can play about with it through the day. Thank you very much for watching this video. Let me know if there's any kind of topics that you want me to cover. Drop a comment down below, like, subscribe, and I'll see you on the next one.